let's clean some chicken <laughs> hello my lovelies welcome back again to Debs's delight today i'm going to show you how i clean and prep my chicken before using it in my cooking it will surprise you to know that cleaning your chicken is not just rinsing it with water but there's so much more that goes into it you'll marvel at the outcome as i clean my chicken i'm not going to waste any more time let's get straight into it this was a lot of chicken and so I needed a big bowl, some lime and my gloves. <laughs> That's all you need. A big bowl because you need enough room to clean the chicken and gloves because you don't want to contaminate the chicken in the process of cleaning it. Of course, your knife. <laughs> so I began by scraping off the excess fat and hair from the chicken. You will marvel at how much hair is still on the chicken when you buy it. Trust me, you cannot cook your chicken without doing this process. So you need to scrape it off with your knife. Being careful you don't hurt your fingers as well as cut into the chicken. And voila, you don't, you definitely don't need that in your chicken, do you? Now I'm paying particular attention to the leg. I'll scrape up the yellowish scales on the leg as you can see on the screen. I must be very honest, it does take a while for you to clean your chicken and get it all ready for cooking. But this is very important because when you're cooking, you need to make sure that your food is healthy as it's going into your body and you don't want to introduce any toxins and any unwanted um, stuff you know, into your tummy. So please be patient and get it all off trust me i do not like prepping ingredients when i'm cooking i love to cook but that is kind of a pain for me but i do gather all the patience within me and make sure that i clean my chicken very well before cooking it so i'm just scraping it all off as you can see there are some baby hairs, I would call them, <laughs> or some feathers still on the chicken. So make sure to plug it all off and scrape it all off. The pores of the chicken contain some fat and some baby hairs within them as well. So if you do not want to take off all the skin before you cook them like myself, please be patient and clean it very well before using it. And just look at that, you don't need all of that there. Mm -mm also for the parts that i believe i won't be able to clean all the hairs off like so i cut that part off with some scissors just so i don't waste too much time or you know go through all the stress of cleaning it <laughs> so i haven't showed you how i clean the chicken i will show you another method as this one is very easy you don't have to waste so much time but sometimes when i do it this way i feel like it cooks the chicken <laughs> so to make it very easy and quicker i add hot water to it yes the hot water softens the skin which in turn softens the excess feather as well as the scales on the leg for the scales of the leg once the hot water touches it all you need to do is to pull it off and just look at that once you get the hot water on the chicken it's quicker and easier so you can also use this method as you won't spend too much time cleaning the chicken if you don't like to spend too much time on your chicken like myself okay As mentioned before, once the hot water touches the chicken, it makes it very easy to scrape off the yellowish part on there. All you need to do is to tear it off and just like magic, it goes off. <laughs> you can also aid it with a knife sometimes, but this is very, very easy. You take the chicken and you just peel it off very very simple so you can add the hot water to it to make your life easier but when you do it this way you need to be very fast about it because you don't want to leave your chicken in the hot water for too long okay 
if you're still here and you're new to this channel welcome to this channel my name is debbie and the name of the channel is debsy's delight and just by the way this is all the dirt on the chicken imagine this going into your tummy please clean your chicken well okay so as i was saying the name of the channel is debsy's delight and on here i share loads of different amazing recipes and i also bring you loads of motivational videos like this one please if you haven't subscribed kindly subscribe to this channel now as it's the only way to support the channel grow thank you <laughs> now the chicken is all clean now but still not ready because what i do is i go in with some lime and this will help take out that strong chicken scent and get your chicken to be extra clean and trust me when you clean your chicken this way for some reason it tastes better when you use it in your food so you, you try it and let me know what you think okay so after adding my lime i'll add some warm water to it and give it a very good wash Once the washing is done, I'll discard the water and further wash it again with some warm water. And I'm giving it a second wash as I want to get rid of all the lime smell as well as you don't want that to overpower your chicken either. You just want your chicken to be clean, void of any strong scents. And my, oh my, I must tell you, this is my favorite part. Every time I'm done cleaning my chicken, I feel so fulfilled and happy. <laughs> As I mentioned earlier, I do not like it at all. So this is definitely a fulfillment for me every time. And just look at that. It looks so, so clean and nice. I'm happy with the results. My mind is always at peace when I'm cooking because I know how much I've washed it thoroughly. And I'm actually confident to eat it. Let me know if you'll be cleaning your chicken this way. Thank you so much for watching till the end. Please don't forget to like, comment subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so and click on the notification button so that whenever i upload a new video you will be instantly notified i appreciate you all so much for the love and support so far so this is not the end guys <laughs> i grilled this chicken and I must tell you, this recipe is a banger. If you'd like for me to show you how I achieved this beautiful oven grilled chicken, you know what to do. Leave it in the comment section. Until I see you in my next video, remember that I love you all, but God loves you the most. Bye for now.